What's going on guys? It's Greg from East Coast Dyes and welcome to Lax Accessory Reviews 12. It's been a long time since we've done one, but we're really pumped to have a really cool set for you guys to check out today. So we're gonna start out with the Synaptec strobe glasses. This is something that Sean found at CES and they're really cool. It's got an adoption from some of the highest levels, the Rolodex of proteins that use these. It's really impressive. Um, and so what you get is this really nice packaging. The link will be down in the description to buy and there's actually 50 bucks off right now because of everyone training at home, obviously. It's a great tool for that. So you can get this really nice case. Inside are the glasses, little manual, little sticker. Uh, so the basic premise of these is they use a certain technology, which is above my head, uh, to black out the lenses for a certain interval of time. So they're smart glasses, they've got little buttons here, but also connect with an app if you want to use them with an app to control them. Um, and I'll turn them on here, uh, comes with a charger and everything. And so essentially you've got settings that control the interval that it blacks out uh, the glasses for. So you can see there they are strobing and you can turn it up so that essentially slows it down. And what this does is helps uh, improve your reaction time. And once you've trained with the glasses and improve your reaction time, it'll essentially slow things down in game for you. So you can, you can incorporate these glasses into drills you already do, uh, like wall ball, like dodging, like shooting. Uh, for goalies, this would be really great. You can even wear them under your helmet. It fits pretty well and they're pretty lightweight. Um, but reaction time is something that people don't often think about training and improving unless you're a face-off guy or a goalie usually. Um, but if you look at like places like IMG that have the mind gym, um, outside of your strength and conditioning and your skills training, uh, working on your mind-body connection, your reaction time is really important. So you put these on and it blacks out the screen and the longer it's blacked out, the more difficult it's gonna be. So for example, if you're playing wall ball and you've got the glasses going, it's gonna make your mind uh, fill in the gaps that it can't see and overall just improve your reaction time and your uh, your hand-eye coordination, which is really, really important for lacrosse. And they're multi-sports. So if you guys also play hockey or football, they apply to pretty much every sport. All right, so we're out on the turf. I'm gonna turn it on, booting it up. All right, so right now it's at level four. I'm gonna start out on the easiest, which is level one. That means it's going the fastest. So you put them on and you can immediately tell, you know, the frames are getting blacked out. So you should be careful. You don't want to start out, hit yourself on the face. To so start out on the fastest setting, move to the slowest, and then, good Lord. Okay, so then you put them on, you get going, you can play wall ball, and it really makes you concentrate, keeping your hand-eye coordination focused on finding that ball, even though some of the frames are blacked out. And as you go faster, you can start moving yourself around. Next product is the Normatec Pulse 2.0. This is something that we found at LaxCon. They're on your feet all day, we need something to recover. They had a whole booth set up, so the whole crew tried them out. Um, and it's essentially a recovery system that uses pulsing and pressure to stimulate blood, th blood flow through your legs and help improve recovery and make it faster. They started out as a medical company and there was a lot of stuff on their website that went over my head, but I've used these after a ton of my workouts, and you've also seen a bunch of pros in the PLL. They'll post their photos uh, before and after games of them using these. Um, it's been really well adopted at the pro level. So what you get, we have the um, Pulse 2.0 backpack with the legs, and you get this really nice backpack and packaging. Open it up, and it has everything that you need, including the pump, which is really easy to use, the tubes, and then the leg attachments. Okay, so you just take each leg. Okay. All right, then you plug them in and you use the pump, turn it on, and then you can set what level you want. So basically how intense you want it to be, and also the amount of time that you want to go for. So we'll go level five, 10 minutes, and you turn it on, sit back and relax. And so it fills it up from the feet up and helps improve your blood flow and it even says it can improve your range of motion just by using them every day. Third and final product is the Inertia Wave Bands. These are a new addition for the ECD Gym uh, and it's one of my new favorite pieces of equipment in there. I've used it pretty much every single workout. Uh, we saw a lot of lacrosse players using them like Kyle Hartzell, Callum Robinson, 
and Paul Rabel. And they've also been used by some of the best professional players in the world, like LeBron James, for example. And so essentially what it is, is a similar product to a battle rope, which we used to have in the gym. So you can see this is what they are. It's uh, these really heavy gauge bands, only weighs about three pounds. And since they are so small and thin, they're really portable. You can really easily bundle them up. Got my hand stuck in there by accident. There we go. Bundle them up, put them in a backpack and take them anywhere with you. They're also really easy to attach. So you get these attachment straps. You can see here I've got them on my sled. You can put them on a chain link fence. You can put them on uh, a treadmill or handles of a stationary bike. So they're really versatile. Compare that to what we used to use, which is a battle rope, which is really clunky, really huge and really heavy and really hard to set up. So essentially what you do with these is it's to work on your endurance as well as your core strength, both of which are really great for lacrosse and your explosiveness. And those pro guys have really seen that they've been really important to their workouts. So you just take the ends, clip them on to the carabiners here, attached to whatever you have them attached to, and then stretch them out. And you can use them for exercises that are really similar to battle ropes, uh, dueling, or you can do both at once and it engages your core, works your endurance and your cardiovascular uh, performance. And then you can also do a variety of core exercises for stabilization uh, where you're going and keeping your core stabilized. Uh, so there's a lot of great workouts you can do for lacrosse and you can incorporate them pretty much in any workout you're doing. So links for all those if you want to learn more or purchase is down in the description. Make sure to let me know in the comments other accessories you want to see us to review. We're always looking to keep these consistent, stock up with cool stuff we can show you guys. So thanks for watching. Let us know if you liked it. Subscribe if you haven't and have a great day.